All right, we're here with uh, Justin Myers of Unicor. Um, Justin, I understand we got a, uh, a new product announcement uh, as of yesterday, uh, making some headlines here at the PGA Show. Of course, the, uh, the Unicorn Mini uh, already had been making a lot of news over the last year in the golf tech and golf launch monitor space. Yeah, and sure. now we've got uh, the Mini Lite. Exactly, um, exactly. Could you Could you kind of walk us through both products, please? Yeah, for sure. Let's start with Mini since it came out first. So yeah. Mini is our first foray into an indoor-outdoor launch monitor. Um, what it does, it has e-ink display up on top, so if you take it to the range or use it indoors, very quick and easy to see your data right on the unit. Uh, it's got 10 points of data on the screen for you, so when you're practicing or playing, you can see those right away. Uh, it's got two high-speed cameras that measure both ball and club data uh, and provide you a, a lot of information uh, very quickly. You can connect it to an iPad app for outdoor use, which will then show you your flight trajectory, your ball groupings for a distance standpoint. It'll also give you um, full impact imagery, so you can see the point of impact both before, during, and after with the cameras. Uh, other than the uh, using it outdoors, you can also pull it indoors and do your full gaming simulation and training inside. Um, the one cool thing about all of our launch monitors, you can use the entire Unicor ecosystem with them. So whether it be just the view software to see your training and, and data numbers, mm -hmm. or even adding our swing optics or balance optics, or even some of our new stuff like the AI trainer and ground vision. Everything works with any of our launch monitors. Very cool. Uh, iMini retails for 4500 and it's available both online and through retailers. And then, yeah, as you mentioned, yesterday we launched Mini Lite. And what Mini Lite does, it's a brand new product. It's super exciting for us. It takes all of that technical data that we just talked about with Mini, uh, from the 18 data points, um, full simulation, full training, but it brings it indoors. So there's no e display, no battery. It does need to be connected to power into a PC, but this comes in at a really big statement price for us at 27.50. So wow. if you want to take the wow. full innovation of Unicorn and bring it home, put it in your garage or even in a covered commercial setting, yep. Mini Light is now one of those like serious, yep. serious contenders. That's awesome. And so as you mentioned, the Mini already was. Uh, an option for both indoors and out. Correct. Uh, very portable. It's got kind of the built-in built-in uh, handle, so you yes. can very easily transport it to the range and back it and set it up inside. But if you want a dedicated, full-time sim setup in your house, uh, you can get in the game for for a really really reasonable price. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And this unit also works on Wi-Fi. So if you've got a place in your house where it's tough to maybe you don't want to trip over your own cables or to yep. undo the power, and move around a little bit, you can certainly do that with this unit. Um, you can also take this unit in the bunker with you or on the putting green. So depending on what you want to practice and what parts wow. of the game you want to improve on, Mini can do just about everything. Wow, that's cool. And uh, both units set up to the side of the ball. Correct. Uh, so space saving opportunities 100%. for people that maybe don't have as much room depth as is required with a, a Doppler radar unit or some 100%. of the competitors. Yeah, well, yeah, as long as you can swing a club freely and comfortably, mm -hmm. um, you can use these units in those spaces. So yeah. we've seen these used with uh, even you know a mat, a net, and then on a TV monitor if you want to see the flight parameters, yeah. or just a mat and a net, you can certainly practice that way too. Very cool. Um, out of the box, um, we've got uh, 10 data points, is that what you said? You've got 10 data points on the display when you uh -huh. use either the iPad app or with your gaming PC you get 18 points okay. of parameters okay. uh, one sticker gives you some additional face and club path pieces so 18 total 10 on display uh, no display here but still same 18 points of data so ball and club data with both units okay do we get uh, we get spin data we do. Uh, do we need a special ball or stickers nope there's one sticker that goes on the toe of the club but it's mm -hmm. super easy to put on and take mm -hmm. off okay um, that's all you need okay you can right. take both units without the sticker though and you'll get uh, you know 90 percent of those parameters just not the club face and sure. the face to path sure information. okay fantastic um, and as you mentioned, the, the Unicor ecosystem is pretty expansive. Um, I see these um, these stance mats. Can you can you tell us what what that technology includes? Yeah, so it's called Balance Optics. It's a it's a balance mat. So it's going to measure your balance and your center of mass before, during, and after your golf swing. So you can see both your weight distribution, heel to toe left, right, side to side. It also tracks the center of your body through your golf swing. So we're gonna track it at the beginning and then on a linear plane through the golf swing and it's gonna mark with an orange dot your actual point of impact. So oh, if you're wow. out practicing and you're inside and you're yeah. working on your weight shift, a lot of times we feel like we've gotten to our left side. Right. This is gonna show you exactly where you are at impact and notice whether you've actually gotten there or you've still stayed a little too much on your right side to, very, very to maximize useful. your efficiency yeah. and power. Right? Yeah. So devices like this, of course the Unicor uh, chiefly, but, all, but golf launch monitors in general the technology has come so far, there's really just tons of game improvement opportunities. I was talking to one of your colleagues who, who played no golf at all before starting to work for Unicor, came from a baseball background and uh, went from a 113 to an 89 within six months, credits, yeah. it, credits it to uh, 
working with uh, all the data and learning quickly. No, absolutely. I think it's one of the things that we're really trying to push into the entire innovative scenario with the golf simulators is that they're all, they're lots of fun. They're great, and gaming is great. And both units can connect to our software or other third-party software. So if you want to play GS Pro or E6 or TGC, yeah. you can do that. But yeah. if you want to take your game to a new level and really start training and practicing, you get so much data and so much consistency with these units that you can really start to improve yourself on a quicker basis. Fantastic. Well, Justin, thank you for your time. And yeah, my uh, pleasure. Congratulations on a, a great grouping of products. Thank you. Yeah, I appreciate yeah, it. Thanks, thank Mark. You. Thanks.